So have you ever walked into a room and forgotten <laughs> why you walked into the room? Justin literally just said this was him this that morning. To me. Well, we have new research giving us some answers as to why that is and what we can do to fight it. So Dr. Alvin Bowman is an assistant professor over at Bonn University School of Psychology. Now he specializes in neuropsychology and is helping us learn more about why we forget and ways we can train our brain to combat that. This is all starting with the doorway effect. So if you transition from one room to another, it could decrease your memory's performance, but experts say all doorways aren't the same. If you're in an elevator and you could transition in a shopping center from one retail level to another, then you essentially cross a doorway, but the context doesn't really change because it's still just retail level. But if you then go to the parking garage, parking level, then it's a bigger change of context. So how do you fight your own brain's forgetfulness? Oliver says you create meaningful memories. Oliver says our brains have built-in preferences of what they deem important and not important.